Luxury cars are expensive because of the high levels of comfort, uniqueness, and status they provide to their users. But what happens when a car is so expensive, even billionaires shudder at the thought of buying it? This is a car even Elon Musk might have to check his portfolio twice before copying. But before we talk about this beast, here are some supercars whose prices can get even the wealthiest of the wealthy scratching their heads. Number 1. The Pagani Waira Roadster BC Starting with the cheapest on this list, we have the Pagani Waira Roadster BC. I say cheap, not because I could ever realistically afford it, but you probably get the context. At $3.5 million, it would take the average American almost 60 years of saving their entire wages to afford this. Sorry, average American, I also feel your pain, but we're talking about some bad boys here, and the Roadster is one heck of a bad boy. Produced by Italian sports car manufacturer Pagani. This hypercar is one of a kind. Actually, it's one of only 40 ever made, and you can understand why, because this baby is packing a punch. Coming with a 6-liter twin-turbocharged Mercedes AMG M158 V12 engine, capable of providing up to 800 horsepower, it's more powerful than the original Pagani Waira and like 90% of all cars. This thing just glides through the road, and when you add in one of the most aerodynamically pleasing designs in any automobile ever to the insane levels of comfort, then you can begin to understand why this roadster costs so much. Number 2. The Lamborghini Sean Imagine a car that costs 10 times more than an Aventador. I'm asking this because most people can't even afford an Aventador, but Lamborghini just casually rolled up with another supercar that can put even Aventador owners to shame. The supercar in question is a $3.7 million Lamborghini Sean FKP37, Lamborghini's first hybrid engine. Fun fact, this beast was based on the Aventador SVJ, but that's just in design, not cost. The Sean is a truly outrageous vehicle. It comes with a 6.5 liter L535 V12 engine, as well as a 48 volt electric motor, which combine to produce over 800 horsepower and make it the most potent Lambo there is. And it's not just all potency, because the design of this thing takes it to a whole nother level. With active cooling vanes for temperature regulation, a large carbon fiber front splitter to maximize downforce, and a transparent glass panel running from the center of the roof, which can be rolled back into the slatted engine cover when you need that ruthless energy, the Sean's design just screams luxury. And when you combine all that with leather upholstery from Ultrona Frau, then you know why you'd have to cough up the cost of a mansion in the Bahamas to get one of the only 63 of these babies in existence. Number 3. The Bugatti Chiron Super Sport 300 Plus The next ride on this list is the ultimate satisfaction for the need for speed. The Bugatti Chiron Super Sport has already set the record as the world's fastest production car with an astonishing top speed of over 300 miles per hour. Hold on though, Bugatti aren't just going to let you run that fast, and they've limited the top speed to just 277 miles per hour. Nothing too fast, you know. This limited edition Chiron supercar is able to achieve this insane speed and also accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour due to the fact that it sports a monstrous quad turbocharged W16 engine which is capable of producing a simply absurd 1176 kilowatts worth of horse power, as well as its uniquely streamlined design, which provides a perfect balance of minimal drag and downforce. This magnificent car is also as luxurious as it is blistering, and there will only be 30 of them produced, which is why purchasing one would set you back up to a whopping $3.9 million. If you ever get the chance, try to ask famous football player Cristiano Ronaldo. He knows all about purchasing the Chiron. Number 4. The Lamborghini Veneno It sure seems like Lamborghini is trying to dry up a fair few pockets because they have appear once again on this list, this time with a $4.5 million Lamborghini Veneno. The first thing I'm going to say is that this is probably the most stylish looking car ever. It looks like something Batman could pull up in to fight the Joker. And it's not even just the looks. This supercar is powered by a 6.5 liter V12 engine, which was upgraded by Lamborghini to produce 740 horsepower and 509 pound feet worth of torque, which makes it great for if you ever want to race your multi-billionaire friend down Hollywood Hill or do whatever it is rich people do with their super agile sports cars. The Veneno is super limited with only 14 ever produced, so it's almost a dream for anyone to get their hands on one. They also come in both convertible and 
coupe body styles, although I don't think that's as important to anyone who isn't a car enthusiast or planning to buy one, because they are the most expensive Lambos ever produced. Number 5. The Koenigsegg CCXR Trevita When Swedish automotive manufacturer Koenigsegg Automotive AB decided to create a more environmentally friendly version of their CCX lineup, they probably forgot to make it pocket friendly, because at $4.8 million, the price of the Koenigsegg CCXR Trevita is certainly not environmentally friendly to most people's bank balances. But that's beside the point, because this supercar is so unique that only two have ever been made. So what is so unique about the Trevita, you might ask? And what I can answer is, a lot. Starting from the unmissable part, the Trevita comes with heavily optimized aerodynamics and a unique white diamond carbon fiber finish, which makes it glisten under the sunlight, so you'll be sure to turn heads with riding this baby. The parts of this supercar you can't see might even be better, because it comes with a whole host of features and can even run on ethanol fuel, which can give it a boost to over 1,000 horsepower worth of room. No wonder famous boxer Floyd Mayweather used to own one. Number 6. The Bugatti Devo This next one is one of Bugatti's latest releases and is actually somewhat related to the Chiron from earlier. Crazy, right? Well, think of the Bugatti Devo as a lighter version of the Chiron, but almost as powerful, with its 8.0-liter quad-turbocharged W16 engine capable of producing 1,500 horsepower. It's not as fast, though, with its max speed of 236 miles per hour being dwarfed by all the latest Chiron models, even though they accelerate at nearly the same rate. The Devo is pretty slick, though, being a track-focused sports car, and there are only 40 of them in existence, which is why they cost a measly $5.8 million. Is that the best you could do, Bugatti? Number 7. The Mercedes Might Buy Accelero It looks like Mercedes were waiting for the right time to make their first appearance in this list, and what an appearance this one is. The Mercedes Maybach Accelero is a special automobile, but it actually wasn't made by Mercedes. Instead, it was made by Stola, which is now part of Bluetech in collaboration with Daimler Chrysler back in 2004. But Mercedes owns Maybach now, so anyways, the Accelero is a sports car straight out of a James Bond movie. The unique design just screams luxury, and I wouldn't be surprised if it could shoot laser beams or something. It's not just good looking, though, as its twin turbocharged V12 engine can generate up to 690 horsepower and support speeds of up to 218 miles per hour. It doesn't come cheap, though, with a starting price close to $8 million. Number 8. The Bugatti Cento Dieci Remember when I asked Bugatti if the Devo was the best they could do? Yeah, it turns out that that wasn't actually the best they could, because here they come again with the $9 million Bugatti Cento Dieci. This limited edition two-door coupe supercar is an homage to the Bugatti EB110 and sports one of the most elegant designs you will ever see on any sports car. It's just a sight to behold. It's as if someone gave Michelangelo and Da Vinci a license to design what they felt the ultimate automobile would look like. It's also really fast, especially as it's related to the Chiron, and just like the Devo, it's also lighter, which makes its 8.0 liter quad turbocharged W16 engines all the more effective, with its 1,176 kilowatts worth of horsepower. Luxury, comfort, top speed, and the fact that there were only 10 units ever produced makes it enough for this car to be one of the most expensive of all time. Surely, Bugatti aren't going to top this one, right? Number 9. The Bugatti La Vautoire Noir I was wrong again, because Bugatti Bugatti are up next once more for their fourth entry in this list with the Bugatti La Vautour Noir. Translated from French, this simply means the black car. And Bugatti took it literal when they rolled out this hypercar in 2019. This monster cost a staggering $18.7 million. Yes, I also had to check the price twice to confirm. But for that amount, you're getting quite simply one of the most exclusive experiences you can ever have in a vehicle. First up, the Vautour Noir has an 8-liter quad-turbo charged W16 engine that can generate up to 1,500 horsepower and 1,180 pound-feet of torque. A top speed of 261 miles per hour isn't the fastest on this list, but compared to my Toyota, it's like the Flash. It also sports a unique design with its six exhaust tips being the pick of the bunch, but the entire body has a sweet carbon fiber finish and wheels look out of this world with the way they illuminate to spell the brand name. When it comes to the interior, you're wowed by the Havana brown grain leather which features aluminum inlays. It truly is 
a work of art, and every part on the car was actually handcrafted, which makes it even more special. And that's exactly why only one Bugatti La Voiture Noire has actually ever been made. So step aside, Andrew Tate. Only the owner of this bad boy is allowed to ask how much my non-existent Bugatti is. Now for the moment you've been waiting for, finally, the car that can get even billionaires stuttering at the price. Roll forward, it's the Rolls-Royce Boat Tail. Everyone else has had their time in the spotlight, so it's time to reveal the ultimate pocket bomber. A car so unique that we've got billionaires speculating over it like it's an asset. A car that redefines luxury. A car inspired by pure nostalgia. The most expensive street legal car ever produced. This car is none other than the $28 million Rolls-Royce Boat Tail. Rolls-Royce's successor to the $13 million Sweat Tail. This car is luxury personified. It features a mechanically deployed parasol, which extends from the rear deck, which itself is finished in Kaleidolegno veneer. Added to this are some rotating cocktail tables with stool seats to match, a complete set of tableware from Christophe, and not one, but two fridges. The car also has a bespoke sound system from Bose Corporation, which uses the floor structure to achieve resonance for when you want to be all about that bass. If you love luxury watches and pens, and the boat tail also has something for you, offering you a choice to own a watch manufactured by Beauvais Fleurier and a Mont Blanc pen. Before I forget, they also come with suicide doors. How neat is that? Away from all the luxury stuff, the Rolls-Royce Boat Tail, which has only three units in existence, is still quite the beast. With its 6.75 twin turbocharged V12 engine, capable of producing 563 horsepower. That's not a lot compared to some of the vehicles on this list, and neither is the 155 miles per hour top speed. But what it lacks in top speed, it more than makes up for in class. So there you have it. Some of the cars that can make even billionaires think twice before buying. Are they worth the price? Which one is your favorite? Is there truly a car which billionaires can't afford? Let us know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video and want to see more like it, then leave a like and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Tap the bell icon to turn on notifications to stay updated with all our latest videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.